The cheetah is a large cat native to Africa and central Iran. It is the fastest land animal, estimated to be capable of running at 80 to 128 kilometers per hour, 50 to 80 miles per hour, with the fastest reliably recorded speeds being 93 and 98 kilometers per hour, 58 and 61 miles per hour, and as such has several adaptations for speed, including a light build, long thin legs and a long tail. It typically reaches 67 to 94 cm, 26 to 37 in, at the shoulder, and the head and body length is between 1.1 and 1.5 meters, 3 feet 7 in and 4 feet 11 in. Adults weigh between 21 and 72 kilograms, 46 and 159 pounds. Its head is small and rounded, and has a short snout and black tear-like facial streaks. The coat is typically tawny to creamy white or pale buff and is mostly covered with evenly spaced, solid black spots. Four subspecies are recognized. The cheetah lives in three main social groups, females and their cubs, male, coalitions, and solitary males. While females lead a nomadic life searching for prey in large home ranges, males are more sedentary and instead establish much smaller territories in areas with plentiful prey and access to females. The cheetah is active during the day, with peaks during dawn and dusk. It feeds on small to medium-sized prey, mostly weighing under 40 kilograms, 88 pounds, and prefers medium-sized ungulates such as impala, springbok and Thompson's gazelles. The cheetah typically stalks its prey to within 60 to 70 m, 200 to 230 ft, charges towards it, trips it during the chase and bites its throat to suffocate it to death. It breeds throughout the year. After a gestation of nearly three months, a litter of typically three or four cubs is born. Cheetah cubs are highly vulnerable to predation by other large carnivores such as hyenas and lions. They are weaned at around four months and are independent by around 20 months of age. The cheetah occurs in a variety of habitats such as savannas in the Serengeti, arid mountain ranges in the Sahara and hilly desert terrain in Iran. The cheetah is threatened by several factors such as habitat loss, conflict with humans, poaching and high susceptibility to diseases. Historically ranging throughout most of sub-Saharan Africa and extending eastward into the Middle East and to central India, the cheetah is now distributed mainly in small, fragmented populations in central Iran and southern, eastern and northwestern Africa. In 2016, the global cheetah population was estimated at around 7,100 individuals in the wild. It is listed as vulnerable on the IUCN Red List. In the past, cheetahs were tamed and trained for hunting ungulates. They have been widely depicted in art, literature, advertising, and animation. The cheetah shows little aggression toward humans, and can be tamed easily, as it has been since antiquity. The earliest known depictions of the cheetah are from the Chauvet Cave in France, dating back to 32,000-26,000 BC. According to historians such as Heinz Friedrichs and Burchard Brenches, the cheetah was first tamed in Sumer and this gradually spread out to central and northern Africa, from where it reached India. The evidence for this is mainly pictorial, for instance, a Sumerian seal dating back to c. 3000 BC, featuring a long-legged leashed animal has fueled speculation that the cheetah was first tamed in Sumer. However, Thomas Alson argues that the depicted animal might be a large dog. Other historians, such as Frederick Zuner, have opined that ancient Egyptians were the first to tame the cheetah, from where it gradually spread into Central Asia, Iran and India. In comparison, theories of the cheetah's taming in Egypt are stronger and include timelines proposed on this basis. Mofdet, one of the ancient Egyptian deities worshipped during the First Dynasty, 3100-2900 BC, was sometimes depicted as a cheetah. Ancient Egyptians believed the spirits of deceased pharaohs were taken away by cheetahs. Reliefs in the Deir el-Bahari temple complex tell of an expedition by Egyptians to the land of Punt during the reign of Hatshepsut, 1507-1458 BC, that fetched, among other things, animals called, panthers. During the New Kingdom, 16th to 11th centuries BC, cheetahs were common pets for royalty, who adorned them with ornate collars and leashes. The Egyptians would use their dogs to bring the concealed prey out in the open, after which a cheetah would be set upon it to kill it. Rock carvings depicting cheetahs dating back to 2,000, 6,000 years ago have been found in Twyfelfontein. Little else has been discovered in connection to the taming of cheetahs, or other cats, in southern Africa. Hunting cheetahs are known in pre-Islamic Arabic art from Yemen. Hunting with cheetahs became more prevalent toward the 7th century AD. In the Middle East, 
the cheetah would accompany the nobility to hunts in a special seat on the back of the saddle. Taming was an elaborate process and could take a year to complete. The Romans may have referred to the cheetah as the leopardos, leopardos or leontopardos, leontopardos believing it to be a hybrid between a leopard and a lion because of the mantle seen in cheetah cubs and the difficulty of breeding them in captivity. A Roman hunting cheetah is depicted in a 4th century mosaic from Lod, Israel. Cheetahs continued to be used into the Byzantine period of the Roman Empire, with hunting leopards being mentioned in the Synegetica, 283-284 AD. In Eastern Asia, records are confusing as regional names for the leopard and the cheetah may be used interchangeably. The earliest depiction of cheetahs from Eastern Asia dates back to the Tang Dynasty, 7th to 10th centuries AD. Paintings depict tethered cheetahs and cheetahs mounted on horses. Chinese emperors would use cheetahs and caracals as gifts. In the 13th and the 14th centuries, the Yuan rulers bought numerous cheetahs from the western parts of the empire and from Muslim merchants. According to the Ming Shilu, the subsequent Ming dynasty, 14th to 17th centuries, continued this practice. Tomb figurines from the Mongol Empire, dating back to the reign of Kublai Khan, 1260-1294 AD, represent cheetahs on horseback. The Mughal ruler Akbar the Great, 1556-1605 AD, is said to have kept as many as 1,000 Kasa imperial cheetahs. His son Jahangir wrote in his memoirs, Tuski Jahanguri, that only one of them gave birth. Mughal rulers trained cheetahs and caracals in a similar way as the Western Asians, and used them to hunt game, especially blackbuck. The rampant hunting severely affected the populations of wild animals in India. By 1927, cheetahs had to be imported from Africa. The first cheetah to be brought into captivity in a zoo was at the Zoological Society of London in 1829. Early captive cheetahs showed a high mortality rate, with an average lifespan of three to four years. After trade of wild cheetahs was delimited by the enforcement of sites in 1975, more efforts were put into breeding in captivity. In 2014 the number of captive cheetahs worldwide was estimated at around 1730 individuals, with 87% born in captivity. Mortality under captivity is generally high. In 2014, 23% of the captive cheetahs worldwide died under one year of age, mostly within a month of birth. Deaths result from several reasons. Stillbirths, birth defects, cannibalism, hypothermia, maternal neglect, and infectious diseases. Compared to other felids, Cheetahs need specialized care because of their higher vulnerability to stress-induced diseases, this has been attributed to their low genetic variability and factors of captive life. Common diseases of cheetahs include feline herpesvirus, feline infectious, peritonitis, gastroenteritis, glomerulosclerosis, leukoencephalopathy, myelopathy, nephrosclerosis and veino-occlusive disease. High density of cheetahs in a place closeness to other large carnivores in enclosures, improper handling, exposure to public and frequent movement between zoos can be sources of stress for cheetahs. Recommended management practices for cheetahs include spacious and ample access to outdoors, stress minimization by exercise and limited handling, and following proper hand-rearing protocols, especially for pregnant females. Wild cheetahs are far more successful breeders than captive cheetahs, this has also been linked to increased stress levels in captive individuals. In a study in the Serengeti, females were found to have a 95% success rate in breeding, compared to 20% recorded for North American captive cheetahs in another study. On 26 November 2017, a female cheetah gave birth to eight cubs in the St. Louis Zoo, setting a record for the most births recorded by the Association of Zoos and Aquariums. Chances of successful mating in captive males can be improved by replicating social groups such as coalitions observed in the wild. The cheetah has been widely portrayed in a variety of artistic works. In Bacchus and Ariadne, an oil painting by the 16th century Italian painter Titian, the chariot of the Greek god Dionysus, Bacchus, is depicted as being drawn by two cheetahs. The cheetahs in the painting were previously considered to be leopards. In 1764, English painter George Stubbs commemorated the gifting of a cheetah to George III by the English governor of Madras, Sir George Piggott in his painting Cheetah with two Indian attendants and a stag. The painting depicts a cheetah, hooded and collared by two Indian servants, along with a stag it was supposed to prey upon. The 1896 painting The Caress by the 19th-century Belgian symbolist painter Fernand Knopf is a representation of the myth of Oedipus and the Sphinx and portrays a creature with a woman's head and a cheetah's body. 
Two cheetahs are depicted standing upright and supporting a crown in the coat of arms of the Free State, South Africa. In 1969, Joy Adamson, of Born Free Fame, wrote The Spotted Sphinx, a biography of her pet cheetah Pippa. Hussein, an entertainment, a novel by Patrick O'Brien set in the British Raj period in India, illustrates the practice of royalty keeping and training cheetahs to hunt antelopes. The book How It Was With Dooms tells the true story of a family raising an orphan cheetah cub named Dooms in Kenya. The 2005 film Duma was based loosely on this book. The animated series Thundercats had a character named Chitara, an anthropomorphic cheetah, voiced by Lynn Lipton. Comic book heroine Wonder Woman's chief adversary is Barbara Ann Minerva alias the Cheetah. The Bill Thomas Cheetah American Racing Car, a Chevrolet-based coupe first designed and driven in 1963, was an attempt to challenge Carol Shelby's Shelby Cobra in American sports car competition of the 1960s. Because only two dozen or fewer chassis were built, with only a dozen complete cars, the Cheetah was never homologate for competition beyond prototype status, its production ended in 1966. In 1986, Frito-Lay introduced Chester Cheetah, an anthropomorphic cheetah, as the mascot for their snack food Cheetos. The Mac OS by 10.0 was code-named, Cheetah. 